If you feel that you are affected with magic and you have sihr and you have jinn touching you, affecting you, the solution is there. You all know this, these surahs. You read, you do ruqya of yourself. There are many adhkar that you can read. Bismillahilladhi la yadurru ma'asmihi shay'un fil ardi wa la fil samai wa wa samir alim. Read it three times after Fajr, three times after Maghrib. You are protected by Allah. The Messenger, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he would even blow and recite on his grandsons, Hassan and Hussein. A'udhu bi kalimatillahi tamma min kulli shaytanin wa hamma. Seeking refuge in Allah from things such as the shayateen and the evil eye. This is in Sahih Bukhari. So how can we say that these things don't exist? Because now we are living in sophisticated times. 21st century rockets and computers and you know all these things. No brothers and sisters these things exist. And perhaps that is why we are affected by these things. I want to conclude by saying, if you feel that there is things happening in your life, again, a disclaimer, first is this, go to the doctor first, never conflate issues with the jinn or sihr with medical issues as well. Sometimes we're quick to go to people and think, oh, everything is black magic. Maybe you've got depression. Maybe you've got low levels of serotonin that the doctor will prescribe you antidepressants. Maybe there's something wrong in your, blo in, your, in, your, in your blood. Do everything from a medical perspective. And if that doesn't work, then you start doing your adhkar. Ya Allah, maybe it's something else. So do adhkar. Pray your prayers. If you're not connected to Allah five times a day with your prayers, there's no way you're going to be treated. No way. Because if you want the solution to come from Allah, then we are not fulfilling our contract with Allah, which is just to pray five times a day. We are, we are contracted to pray five times a day. Bain al-Abdi wa bain al-Kufri tarkus salah, the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa said. That the difference between us and leaving and going out of the fall of Islam is when we leave off the prayer, we don't pray. So return back to Allah, pray five times a day, and then do your adhkar. Blow over yourself, recite over yourself. I pray Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows us to understand the true solutions that are found in the Quran and Sunnah when it comes to dealing with situations and issues such as sihr and magic. And I pray Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allows us to stay away from these, the people who call towards resolving our issues in the community, yet they are working with the jinn, yet they are increasing the magic on you. And they are turning you away from the true solutions that are found in the Quran and Sunnah. Please like, share, and subscribe to the Digital Member YouTube channel and hit the notification bell. Please also like, share, and subscribe to our Facebook and Twitter. Links in the description of this video.